Falls, this is a really exciting video, so stick around. Before this video starts, I want to let you guys know that I'm actually teaming up with Resultly, and I am doing a contest where one of you guys is going to win $100, and I think that's pretty cool. So in Resultly, you can make collections of things that you like, whether it's makeup or clothes or whatever. I've used Resultly on my channel in the past, if you've noticed. So basically, all you have to do to enter and win this really exciting contest is you have to sign up for Resultly. Then I want you guys to make a collection called Perfect Thanksgiving Outfits. Make it fun, make it whatever you want. I just want holiday-inspired clothing items. <laughs> I'm looking for inspiration as well, so I'm really excited to see what you guys have. So it's really easy. You basically just go on there, search through all the stuff. The site is super easy to figure out, I promise. You make your collection. You can call it Thanksgiving Miss Ellen Mellon giveaway or something like that. And make sure it's stuff that you actually like, because if you win, you get $100 worth of things that are in your collection. So say you go on, you post, um, you know, a little black dress with some burgundy heels and a Michael Kors purse and a magic watch or something like that. You get $100 of whatever you put in there. So say the dress is $60 and the shoes are $40, you would get the dress and the shoes, but you get to pick what you want. I hope I'm making sense. So after you create your collection with at least 10 items in it, all I need you to do is send out a tweet using the hashtag MissEllen100 and just put the link to your collection in the tweet. So basically I'm just going to go through, I'm going to search the hashtag MissEllen100, look at all the tweets, see all the collections, and then I'm going to go on there, pick my favorite collection, and then in my next video I will be announcing the winner. So make sure you're following my videos to see when I announce the winner. Don't worry, I'll put it in the title of the video or something. And of course you have to be subscribed to my YouTube channel because this is for my melon balls. So yeah, if you're the winning collection, you get $100 worth of stuff from your Thanksgiving outfit collection. Any holiday fun inspired stuff like that, I can't wait to see it. So I just thought this would be super fun. Again, all the information will be in the description if you want to go read over that again. Make sure you got it all down, right? And uh, that is it for the giveaway information basically. Now we will be moving on to my room tour. All right, so this is the foyer and then this right here is my bedroom. So when you first go in, this is what my room looks like. And I know it actually looks really different when I'm filming my videos to you guys because, well, now all you see is the blue, but the pink is still there. Um, I'm just trying to slowly get rid of the pink. Okay, so this is my door when you walk in. My purse is up here. I have a what's in my purse video if you want to see what is in that beautiful bag right there. Right here I have my bigger tote bag. I just keep my two purses right here. This is Coach. Um, I've had it for quite a while. It's from their Poppy collection and the inside is red as you can see. And right here I have my car keys and it is on my little monogram keychain from glitzyglam.com. So I guess we're going to go around the room this way because I don't really know how else I'm supposed to do it. <laughs> so right here are all my scarves and I have way too many scarves and I try to get rid of them but like I just like them too much and I try to organize it these are more wintry and then I don't know it's kind of a mess but these are like the black and white ones back here I've just got way too many scarves some of which have the tags on them like it's sort of sort of a wreck so from there we come over here and this is what this side of the room looks like oh hey that's me <laughs> okay so up here I've got some prayer flags and these I got in Nepal I just really like them I know they are not the most classy decoration but they just remind me of my trip which I just got back from so they might not stay up there forever but they're just there for right now okay Okay, over here I've got some flowers which my boyfriend gave to me which was very sweet of him except they're sort of dying now and I should probably take care of that so here you see I've got so here I've got a crystal and I've got another crystal here I've also got my candle and my little Buddha you will probably notice that I have quite a few Buddhas in my room but um, I do not label myself as a Buddhist I feel I don't need to pick a label but um, I enjoy Buddhist teaching so right here I have a picture which is a really old Old picture of me and my best friend Rage and we are underwater and that is from middle school so throwback. Right here I have my jewelry box and obviously I made this little thing myself and in here is zebra which I don't really like. Um, okay so over here I usually keep my watch and my bracelet that I'm wearing right now because I wear those every day and on this side I keep my Alex and Annie bracelets which are usually right there and then I just have a bunch of stuff that I wear on like a pretty often basis uh, a pretty often basis is that even like a word in this little thing i've got a bunch of books I've got some yearbooks i have some ghost stories as you notice i like ghost an astrology book i have a wreck this journal which you can kind of see i have done a little bit down here i have more like 
foo-foo-y books. Is that a, does that make sense? Like up here I have informational yearbooks, stuff like that, like more like textbook sort of things. Down here I have more like fun reading books. Shout out to fellow YouTubers. I have the Elle and Blair book and my best friend Rage got me this book and this is the Honey Boo Boo book, and this is my most prized possession. Okay, so in the bins, this bin is one of my favorite bins in my room. I really enjoy this. I took it out of its shelf so I could kind of show you, but in here, I have all of my Christmas candles, and these just go on. I stock up on these every year. These are all Christmassy. This is another Christmas one. These are just some wall plugins that I have because I have a wall plugin thing over there. Just got some little individual candles if I feel like switching out whatever I have in my room. And here I have some incense because I really like incense. Okay, this next bin is an embarrassment. It goes from my favorite to an embarrassment. This is just sad. So we have my camera. There is some like bronzer. Why is bronzer in here? There's like a makeup kit. Um, there's hair extensions, medicines, uh, curling irons. I didn't even know I had that many curling irons. I honestly haven't looked in this bin in forever. Some makeup sponges. Those look old. I forgot to show you right here. This is a, like, a speaker that I need to put in my car. It doesn't have a place in my room, so it's just sort of sitting here. And this is chalk because you'll see over there I have a little chalkboard, so I need it. I just keep some chalk right here. And in this bin, it's just a bunch of old school supplies, and I'm not even in school right now, but I still have school supplies. Moving over here, this bag is all stuff that I plan to do a video on. Everything in there you guys will see at a later date. All right, coming up here, I really like this corner. So as you can see, I'm burning an incense right now. Incense, incense, what? And it's in my little like hand incense burner and I love it. And right here, this is just like a decoration, but I put this, uh prayer bead around it and it has like the ohm symbol on it and everything and I got that when I was in Nepal. This little elephant guy I also got when I was in Nepal. He doesn't have a name though. If you guys would like to name him, feel free to leave a comment. Tell me what I should name this little bud. Up here I have my little dream catcher except this does not work. Okay, let me tell you, I have two dream catchers in my room and I had awful dreams last night. So and over here I have a big Chinese lantern and then right here I have pictures of doggies. So in the middle is obviously my perfume tray. I've got my DKNY ones, my Taylor Swift ones, a Balenciaga, Scentbird, Pink Sugar, Michael Kors. I don't know, it's like the Harajuku one. I've got a bunch of like samples here. I've got like Taylor Swift. Oh, this is like my favorite perfume. It's called Bootsy. I love that stuff. Then I've got some just like body mist in the back. And then over here, this is obviously not a perfume because it has abs on it. It's my boyfriend's cologne and that's dorky, but whatever. This is my chest of drawers, which I keep a lot of my clothes in. And usually I would skip over this drawer, but you guys already know so much about me, so I don't even feel ashamed. Over here I've got my pajamas. Yeah, I wear Christmas pajamas year round. And I've got underwear back there, bras here obviously, that's one of my sassy bras. Here I have like bralettes and sports bras and stuff like that, and that's enough of that drawer. So here I have big t-shirts. I've got ones from old plays. I have my Apple Think Different t-shirt. And then here I have tank tops and camis like just white camis and basics. Back here is a bracelet that's too big to fit in my regular jewelry stuff. Then I have some jewelry boxes that I just feel like I should hang on to. Okay, this is all my jewelry. This probably isn't the best way to store it, but I don't really have a problem with it. The first one is the smallest one. This is all my like Christmas and like holiday themed jewelry, so I'm not gonna go through all that. This one, I have just bigger items, so I've got like watches bangles, big prom earrings, you know. And then here, obviously, it's just a bunch of little compartments. I just keep everything in here. You know, there's earrings, rings, necklaces, you know, all my jewelry, basically. Next drawer, this is a pretty boring drawer, but uh, here is all my yoga pants. I'm a big yoga pants fan. Here's my workout pants. This is my crazy pants pile. I buy a lot of crazy pants and they're just like loose, flowy, bohemian looking pants and I love those. Oh hey, there's my melon ball shirt. This pile is all just like plain t-shirt. This bottom drawer is not even closed. Okay, on this side, I have all my bathing suits and I haven't touched these in a while, so. Then this bin is just a bunch of like lotions, extra, um, I've got body wash that I just like haven't used yet, you know, if I buy extras of stuff, I just sort of put it in here and that's just like my stockpile for all my lotions and body wash and stuff like 
like that. Over here, I have some random travel stuff. These are all like travel bags that I take. They're filled with shampoos and conditioners and stuff like that. I've got deodorant, travel size, nail polish remover. Here you see I have microderm abrasion tips for my PMD, which is in one of these bags. And I also have a stack of bandanas because I don't know where else to put them. Okay, over here I've got some shoes. These are just the shoes that I find that I wear like all the time. So I just recently put out like my Uggs and I've got my um, combat boots and just, I don't know, they're all sort of brown, aren't they? I guess I like brown shoes. Coming over here, I've got my makeup. I've got some pictures up here which are really outdated and I seriously need to update, but uh, here is where I store all my makeup and I have an entire makeup collection video if you wanna see what's in here. It's not as pretty looking right now, I don't know why. And yeah, I've got my phone charging here too. It is 7.38 p.m. Okay, so coming over here is my bed, obviously, and this is more what you guys are used to seeing about like a perspective like that and then usually me sitting in front of it but uh yeah this is where I film my videos everything like that I've just got throw blanket some pillows that is my teddy bear named Mr. Snuggles and I have slept with him every night for a really really long time over there I have another dream catcher but it still doesn't work. Hey, okay, over here I've got some flowers. I have this, which is a singing bowl. I got this in Nepal, and if you don't know what a singing bowl is, you're missing out. And then this is like one of my favorite gifts that I've ever gotten. Shout out to my other best friend, Jerry. She's adorable. It's a book that she put a bunch of pictures in that just says a bunch of really cute things, and she's adorable. A lot of them are screen caps from my videos. <laughs> okay, so over here up top, I've got my candle, which I just got. It's mahogany teakwood, and I actually, this is the first time I've ever bought one of these things at Bath and Body Works that you like put around your candle, but it's so pretty. So I just started burning that. Back here, I have a Miss Ellen Melon video list. This is a camera. It does work. I don't use it, I use it as a decoration, uh, but I think it looks cute because I love photography. Here I've got some binders. This one is totally empty. This one has, I have no idea what this one has. This is my journal, hoo hoo. This is really cute. This is like a ticket stub thing, which my best friend Rage got me. I talk about Rage a lot here. You like get ticket stubs and you put it in there and you write stuff about it and it's just really cute. This I've talked about in videos before. This is a one line a day. Uh, journal diary sort of thing. You just write one line every single day for five years and I like it. Okay, under here I've got some drawers. This says lotion and then these other two say supplies. Now I know this says lotion, but surprise! It's not. It's a mess is what it is. Okay, <laughs> down here I've got some hand sanitizers. Here I've got like first aid beauty repair cream. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot I had this. This is like a foot soak from Bath and Body Works. Got like, this is, this is awful. Got a bunch of like self tanners back here. This like, ugh, no, I'm just closing this drawer. Next drawer, it is all supplies basically here. I've got some journals that I either have yet to write in or are finished. Got some pens. These are pencils that have Mean Girls quotes on them. The bottom one is all just like, I don't know, push pins, pens, stuff like that. Down here is pretty boring. I've got some like random GoPro mounts in this thing. Um, this is my old MacBook, which like barely even works anymore. Here I've got some melatonin and like sleep spray, which you put on your pillow in case I can't fall asleep. This drawer has a bunch of random electronic stuff in it. This is like GoPro gear. This is an old iPad case. It's got like old iPhone boxes. Just a bunch of stuff, honestly. I don't know, I don't think you guys are too interested in electronics, but that's all that is. And then in this box, this is totally random too. Okay, I have a light bulb, which I use for my softbox when I'm filming videos. I have a calculator, like a school calculator. And then I have backup hard drives because, you know, why not put those things together? That sounds logical, right? Okay, over here I have my little, um, what's this called, wallflower from Bath & Body Works. I was showing you guys the plugs for earlier, and I've got some random shoes down here. I've got my Snook Sperry's, just some random sandals, and some nude flats. I feel like those are just basics, and I keep them out all the time. This is my closet door, which my closet is way too small. It does not hold everything I need it to, but you work with what you got. So over here I've got my sassy robe, which I'm in love with. It's cheetah print, and it's just fabulous. And I have like a random winter coat. I don't know why that's there. There's my mirror. Hey. I've got an old picture of my friends and I from, I guess this wasn't, this was my freshman year. Yeah. And I adore this picture for 
Ugh, all the memories. Okay, I don't know where to start here. So this is my closet. I guess I'll start at the top. Back there is a box of old stuff that reminds me of memories that I don't want to remember right now, so we're not going to talk about it. Here is a pillow, a festive pillow for Christmas, which you guys will see in a few months. Okay, then I've just got some boxes. This one is labeled bags. It's more like wallets, just like old wallets. The next one has some hats in it. I've got my monogram hat, my Starbucks hat. I've got some earmuffs, some cute just little berets. Ooh, I should try to wear this tonight. This is labeled miscellaneous because as you guys have been able to tell by now, I love having random miscellaneous drawers. This is fun. I've got a measuring tape. I have a um, knitting needle. I have another light bulb. I have, I think that's a first aid kit. Here we've got a sewing kit and whoa, some water enhancer. Like why the heck do I have that there? This bin up here is actually pretty fun. This is like my purse bin. I guess that's what you can call it. All right, so in here I just have all my purses that I like but I'm just not using currently. This was like my summer bag. Like, I love that bag, but I just can't use it right now. Down here, I've just got some other smaller purses, as you can see. Up here is my bin full of craft supplies. It is literally nothing but craft supplies. I don't know if you can see in there or not, but um, there's so much stuff in there, I just don't feel like digging it out. And then up there is just like, I have a backpack, some luggage. That's like my pool bag that I use in the summer. Okay, starting over here, this is a bin full of like... Um, Spanx and just like, I don't know, stuff to suck you in. Then right here I've got my sunglass case. This first drawer I've just got a bunch of like hair bows. This is all my headbands, which is really full. <laughs> this drawer is sunglasses, which is also really full, including my mustache sunglasses. How cool are these? And this bin is also sunglasses. This is a continuation of my electronics drawer, which you saw earlier. Everything is as labeled. And here I just have some cameras. Here's my like, iOS is like all Apple products, so like my phone, my iPad, adapters, I don't, I just, I have like one thing in there. I've got old phone cases, which is like so full. I've just got phone cases that I'm not using right now. An extra charger for my computer. This one has like old iPods and weird stuff. This is a charger, except it's not in there, so never mind. These are Canon cables. This is GoPro stuff. Here we've got some extra headphones. This is a bin full of old phones, but this is so full. I'm not even going to try to open it. And then up here is my Nikon charger for my nice camera. All right, over here we've just got sweatshirts, like an overabundance of them. There's my melon ball one. Can you see it? Over here I have some shoes hanging. I've got Vans, flats, some flip-flops. Okay, then there's all my clothes. I try to put them in color order just because it makes me happy. So it just is all like tops and shirts and everything. And then it goes over to jeans and then jackets. And then actually back here is where I keep all my statement necklaces. As you can see, there's just way too many statement necklaces to keep like in my jewelry box. So I just keep them back here on a hanger. Okay, down here, first of all, let me show you my slippers. These are my Snooky slippers, aka my sneaker slippers, whatever you want to call them. They're the best in the winter. I love these things. I've just got my running shoes, my Nikes, and my hiking boots back here. And then there's just a bunch of heels that I don't wear on a normal basis. And yeah, they're a little messy. No one's perfect. All right, down here I've got my socks. This is the same as in my last room tour. These are all my fuzzy socks, which I wear in the winter, and yeah. I have a lot of them. I really enjoy fuzzy socks. Then down here are just like my regular socks. I have like um, the socks that you wear with flats, casual cat socks, everything like that. Over here I have all my belts and these aren't very well organized either. It's just a drawer full of belts, but I can always find what I need. So it always works out okay. I've got my sparkly belts, got my bow belts. Over here are all my pantyhose. Um, one extra pair of socks that didn't fit in the other drawer. I've got some like tights for Halloween and everything. I've got my Christmas tights. I love being festive. Okay, closet done. Coming over here, I've got my trash can. That's super fun. Here I have my bag, which I keep my camera in, which I am using right now. Usually I would show you, but not in there. This is my desk. As you can see, I've got a little monogrammed thing up on the wall, like a vinyl decal. And I have this little thing around it that I made, which I think is sort of cute. I have my computer with my chevron keyboard. Over here I have some sunglasses. These are just the ones that I wear most often. Here I actually have my medicine, like daily medicine I have to take. Here is an SD card, which is full, and I have to edit the videos on it. That's my lens cap. Oh, over here is just a card that my mom got me. Oh, and these are my little Buddha friends. Look, 
at this baby. It is like a twerking Buddha baby. Maybe he's not supposed to be twerking, but that's just how I'm gonna look at it. In my drawer here, whoa. Just got like office supplies, you know, the huge. Down here I have a journal. I have a jar of change. Oh, and I have this cute little thing. Look, there's like incense and everything in it. I like that a lot. Then down here I have some CDs, like blank CDs back there. I have even more blank CDs in their cases. And then this here is my bin full of stationery because I love stationery. And yeah, I'm sitting on the floor right now. Don't mind me. Christmas stationery, just all kinds of stuff. Woo, that is my entire room, you guys. That took long enough. Now I wanna make a note that I feel like there's an expectation that all beauty gurus on YouTube are like perfect human beings. And you will see that I have, uh, you know, my room is not perfect. <laughs> I have some messy drawers. I have some unorganized things. And I just wanted to say that's what real life is like. I'm sorry. I'm not perfect. I'm not super rich like some of the girls on YouTube pretend to be. And I'm not trying to be salty either. And I'm not naming names. I'm just saying uh, this is a real room tour. This is my real room. So I'm sorry if it's not as perfect as you were hoping it to be. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It was requested like crazy ever since I put up my tapestry and changed it around a few pillows. Everyone was like, updated room tour. Make sure you enter the result league giveaway. I can't wait to give one of you guys $100 worth of stuff that you like. With all of that being said, I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for sticking around till the end of my video. If you're still watching, you're the bomb.com. I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.